It is 1246 now and good Wednesday. It has been a wet one so far, even though some of us started off with a little sunshine early. We watched one batch of rain swing through brought about a quarter of an inch so far in West Bend, Burlington, about two tenths of an inch and about 15 hundredths of an inch in Milwaukee with a nice still downpour right around 11 o'clock this morning. There was that line that swung on through. Now we just have a few lingering showers pushing into Sheboygan County, moving out of Washington and Ozaki County, but still hanging out around the Auburn area and that will continue to move up to the north and to the east. Most of us as we go into the afternoon, we'll just look at plenty of this gray cloud cover. Temperatures, however, are going to be pretty mild. 60 degrees at the moment in Menominee Falls. A little bit breezy as well with a southerly wind. We are ahead of the cold front, so that's why the wind still from the south and our temps are still pretty warm. Look off to the west, though, behind this cold front temperatures dropping about 20 degrees. So this is what's on tap for tomorrow. Not going to quite look at temperatures in the 30s, 38 right now in Minneapolis, but still a huge contrast in the temperatures. They're at 72 in Chicago. We're at 64 here in Milwaukee, so we're going to stay in the 60s the rest of the afternoon. Here's a little bit of a break in the activity, so just an isolated rain chance as we go throughout the afternoon. This rain down by St. Louis, that's going to move its way into our neck of the woods as we go into the late evening and overnight hours. It's causing quite a bit of severe weather down to the south, however, and that could rob us of some of our energy as we go later into the overnight hours. However, we are still expecting the heaviest rain to be late tonight. The rest of your afternoon again, a spotty shower here or there. Most of us though just cloudy, warm and breezy overnight. Radar filling in quite nicely with lots of greens and yellows and oranges showing some moderate to heavier downpours possible as we head into your Thursday morning. And then eventually this storm system, at least this particular one, comes to an end by the afternoon. Then it gets cooler and breezy with a westerly wind. Heading into your Friday, we may start off with a peak of sunshine. Another storm system though on the way will bring rain chances back to the forecast by Friday afternoon. How much rain to expect? Generally about a half an inch up to an inch total by the time this first storm system is done. And yes, we've got more in the seven day forecast for today though. Again, just a spotty shower throughout the afternoon. 68 warm and breezy. Lots of cloud cover today. Then overnight, that's when the heaviest of the rain will fall. 46 here overnight low with showers and a few thunderstorms possible. Again, could see up to an inch by tomorrow morning that it's going to get much colder. 52 your high temp in Milwaukee. It's going to feel colder than that though, especially compared to our mild day today and you add in that wind a little insult to injury, but again, at least we get some dry time by the end of the day. Friday starts off dry and on a wet note though, so keep the umbrella with you. Keep it in your car all week if you can, and then we get into your Saturday starting off with a dry day, but it's going to end up on the wet side. Temperatures dropping to around 48 for a high. Again, not the 30s like they've got in Minnesota, but still cooler air on the way for the weekend and shower chances really ramp up yet again on Sunday. And as we go into May, more chances for rain.